Hi everybody, it's me, Jenny. Welcome back to my channel here at Craft Creations. Please, if you like this video, like it, comment, subscribe, share, you know, all the YouTube thingies. <laughs> Anywho, so today I am back. Oh my gosh, guys, I am having so much fun playing with Anna's dies at Crafting World Designs, my Crafting World Designs. Um, if you are interested in anything that you see in my uh, design team videos, make sure that you use my discount code. Um, it's Jenny10. It'll save yourself 10% um, at the end of your order. But today we are here. <laughs> I was going to do a few, but I have to just give each one of these dies their own special video because they are that awesome. So we are doing the, um, this is called... The, uh, the add-on. Oh, I thought I saved the... Oh, maybe I didn't. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, boy. Yes, I did. Silly me. Okay, this is called the Border Dye Add-on Gingerbread Treat Box. Um, and you get a bunch of dyes, and they are so cute. And listen, we all know... Sorry, I have these tiny little pieces that I wanted to save. Oh, but anywho. We know how we like doing... Um, crafting, oh, how do I say it, um, like a theme, right? So Anna, being as amazing as she is, she actually has a theme going on. So she has that incredible ginger dye that I showed you guys last month. And with that dye last month, she has one that is identical to this, but it's smaller and it's a Memdex card. And it is by far the cutest thing. So with this, and those two other dies, you can make such an incredible swap or happy mail or, or the, the list just goes on. So with this, I do not have the original box um, that Anna first designed. So I made my own boxes. Um, but guys, I did it two different ways. Now the way that you'll see on the website in Anna's shop is the first one I'm going to show you and it is the cutest thing. The only thing I did not use was the face. Um, I did a stamp from Peachy Cheap because it, I just, that's what I do. Anyway, <laughs> so let me show you the first one because this is just incredible guys. Oh my gosh. Do, 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 do. I'm going to call him Charlie. <laughs> I don't know why, but Charlie just seems to work. So what I did was, look at how stinking cute. So this is the way that um, Anna actually shows the way the box goes. And I love it. But I did it a little differently as well. Because, you know, listen, you can use these dies in so many different ways. And as crafters, we try to come up with a bunch of different ways to use a die to get more life out of it, if you will say. Um, so I did, I, these are, so I thought these were shaker beds. They're not, but they could be. Um, but I put them to, I guess it's supposed to be like snow. I'm not really sure, just a decoration, but it looks incredible. So what I did was I used, um, foam, like a sparkly white foam and it's sticker. So I didn't have to glue all of these crazy little things. I just had to take the backing off and just stick it on. And it is like, oh, it's stuck. It's not going anywhere. Um, and then I did this, as you could see, it's like a, like a goldish silver kind of color. It's absolutely stunning. And then I had these in my stash. Um, so I put those on for the little buttons and then I did his face and I did some highlighting and some cheeks, but look at how stinking cute this is. So I put the shred in here just because I'm going to show you, um, you can see like, you know, how the box sticks on. Oh, and I also used two pieces of foam. Um, for each little paw or foot or whatever you want to call it. Um, but I put the shred in here. Now, obviously, if you fill it up, you don't need this much for, uh, shred. You could just put your goodies in here. Um, and you could fit so many different things. I just think this is so stinking adorable. So this is box number one. And then I did turn this into a shaker, guys. But I'm just so excited. Let me just show you. So I'm going to show you the one side first. Do, 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 do. Look at how stinking cute. So this is just the the die. Um, and it's I put the box, as you can see, in the middle. So you could put a ton of goodies in here as well. I mean, that's a pretty big box. Um, and you will see, I'm so sorry. 
Um, you will see, my dog is going crazy. <laughs> I don't know what she's barking at. Um, you will see the design team and the way that they are doing the boxes is so super cute as well. But I just wanted to show you different ways that you can do it. So like I said, I did this one like this, this one like this. Now let me show you the shaker. You ready, ready, ready. Ah, look at that shaker. <laughs> of course I'm shaking out all the bits, but that's okay. <laughs> we'll just move them. Look, how stinking cute. Now I did, I think I made a boo-boo, but I'm not sure. So yes, I turned this into a shaker. You ask, how did I do that? Well, let me tell you because it's so easy. <laughs> and for me to say it's easy, uh, you know, that that's saying something. So what I did, and I just used the die. I didn't use anything different. So I cut this out twice. Um, and then I took, uh, did I, do I still have it? No, I don't shoot. I used it for another one. Um, so I basically, what I did is I cut like here. So I had this part. So I just kind of lined it up and made the squigglies go as much as I could that way. And then if there was like, cause here and here, I was just afraid there was a little bit of a hole. Now I'm fortunate because these bits are bigger. Um, but if you want to use tiny bits, so what I did was I just put a bunch of glue where these two ends on this side and these two ends on this side met up so that nothing could seep through if I decided to do, oh, I did it again, <laughs> if I decided to do smaller bits. So I just think it came out so stinking adorable. Um, there I go. So I, I love the way this came out. And then what I, where I think I screwed up is I put acetate, like a dig bat. So I did the the feet and then I put the acetate over the feet and made these two shakers which isn't a problem and in a way I'm kind of glad I did it because some of these are so flat they may have just kind of fallen through but I don't know if I needed to do that step I should have just left it alone did the um the foam as you can see on the inside um but yeah I mean it worked out perfect I think this is so stinking cute so if you're in a swap and you have to make a shaker this is a great way to do it um, I just think it is such a fun die and there are so many ways that you can use it. And then look at how cute that looks even with, with it not shaking. <laughs> and then if you didn't want to do the shaker side and you just wanted to hang out and do this side, I think that is super cute. But both of these boxes are adorable. Now this one is bigger, um, as far as like deeper, I should say. Um, I guess they're about the same. Yeah. Uh, yeah, they're about the same length. They're, it's just this one is deeper than this one. But either way, it is adorable, and I love it. And again, guys, if this is your die and you purchase it, you could do whatever you want with it. So if you do purchase this and you make it, could you please tag me on your videos, A, so that I know you have a YouTube channel or Instagram, um, so that I could see it and then I could subscribe or follow you or both. Um, that would be awesome. So yeah, and then I would love to see how you guys made yours and what you did. But I just love the way that they both came out. I think either way you do it is amazing. I know that, um, oh, uh, I forget. She's on the design team and for the life of me, I cannot think of her name. Oh, you know her though. But she did a box that is so stinking cute and she has a, um, oh, Sinfully, sin Sinfully Crafts something like that. Anyway, sorry. <laughs> um, she did a box and she didn't use the, the paws, I guess is what we'll call them. Um, and it came out adorable. Oh my gosh. She did this cute little, um, pink trim. And so definitely just go check all, check out all of the different ways that you can design this. Anna did a beautiful one. Um, so yeah, let me know what you guys think. I just think these are just so stinking cute. I love the way that they came out. I can't wait to gift these out. I hope whoever receives them will love it. Um, again, this is the die. These are all the pieces that you get. Um, so let me know and don't forget to use my code if you decide to purchase it and let me know what you guys think. Which one is your favorite? Which way do you like it? You know, which way do you like it better? I guess. I don't know. I can't pick a favorite. I think they're both so stinking cute. Um, but yeah, so let me know. And I hope you guys are having a great day. And I hope to see you in my next video. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. It would truly mean the world to me. I'm really trying to grow my channel. 
and it has not been easy. So thank you so very much. I love you guys and can't wait to see your comments. Bye. Oh, and I'll be back to share the ribbon candy next. <laughs>